Hello everyone, welcome to the crazy project where I'm mining an entire Minecraft world. On the last episode we have connected all of the border on that side and today what I want to do is to try and uh, do basically the same thing on this side of the border. It's uh, It will be hard because we need to cut through that mountain. So what I need to do is to pick up those beacons and then pick up the actual beacons which are still in the other pyramids and cut through this mountain because after we keep this line over here we are going to to reach this mountain and if we actually surpass it we will have on this other side the other corner it's right there so today we have a really really big problem to solve i i don't know how much uh, and how far we can reach but uh, let's try it let's go I am very quickly realizing that I probably took more than what I should for this episode but uh, you know me, I, I am going definitely keep trying I have more or less defined a, a border or of where the beacons can more or less reach now it's just a matter of peeling off the, the snow layers, the dirt layers, maybe mine a little bit and uh, yeah, that's it uh, before going back to work just to Give you a reminder, we have a community discord now, so uh, if you want, there is a link in the description uh, below and uh, while you are there, uh, leave a comment or something, I, I really enjoy reading your comments, so uh, yeah, do that, meanwhile I'm going to very quickly repair the tools and yeah, let's keep going. <music> It has been a very hard job, even when you think that I am already doing a very hard job. So, the, whenever it rains, it covers everything with snow, so I sometimes miss the spot. Uh, actually, I thought I missed this one, but no. Uh, and there is another issue, which is that thing over there, uh, the powder snow. It's it's different than the snow block, because the snow block, it goes instaminable, like this. This one... No, it is uh, it is basically the same as if I would be mining by end, which makes it very, very annoying. Anyway, all of this area, although it might not look like, it's done. Uh, so I need still to peel all of this uh, side of the hill from the snow and the dirt. And after that, I, I, I'm not sure if I'm going to wrap up the episode or maybe still I have a little bit of more time to, to put the, the snow layers down but as you guys can see today it has been a while and uh, yeah, yeah, yeah well, well, well let me repair the tools let's keep pushing and then we speak a little bit more in the end <music>
the end of what I would consider another very successful episode. Take a look on how the world used to be and now you guys can see it, it, it really goes uh, from all of these sections over here, all of this hill, all built and trust me the snow layers, there are just snow layers, there is no snow behind, I have actually mined uh, all of this, it's, it's crazy, it's amazing and it's insane and now we have the third side of the border complete, so uh, we are only one down, which is great. Now, giving a quick tour on the statistics, uh, we are well above the 6 million blocks of stone right now and I'm actually curious, so we mine more than 25,000 blocks of stone, that's pretty cool, uh, 11,000 blocks of ice, uh, pretty cool overall if you ask me. Uh, anyway, I uh, just to reply to one of your questions, as usual, uh, you guys ask me how I stay motivated and uh, the truth is I stay motivated because I truly enjoy doing this project and I am very happy with the positive uh, feedback that all of you guys leave in the comments down below, all of the kindness and uh, the very uh, heartwarming words that you left. So uh, yeah, that's my motivation, that's all I need, that's the fuel for this project. I really hope that you have enjoyed guys and uh, yeah, I really hope to see you on the next one.